New at six in English, compadre means godfather, the person at a baptism chosen by the parents to be their child's father if necessary. To reduce the risk of child abuse, the Children's Shelter has a new program called Compadres y Compadres, a 12-week program open to any dad in Bear County. Jesse de Goyado talks to three graduates who went on to get further training as mentors for other fathers. As you guys can see, three grown men using room. three tiny mannequins to learn the art of gently massaging and soothing a baby. Just tapping all the way around, all the way around, all the way down to their stomach. Adding this to their parenting skills that they as mentors can pass on to other dads. Two out of the three say they were referred by Child Protective Services. Still, all of them say they're grateful for what Compadre y Compadre has taught them. Because it opened my eyes into uh, seeing how beautiful it is to be a father. Not just being a provider, you know what I'm saying? Not just being uh, financially there, but being there emotionally. I took it home with me every day. Every class I came, I took it home and I applied it in my everyday life. We're talking about shaking baby syndrome. Compadre y Compadre also teaches how to avoid harming a child out of frustration by learning proper discipline and the art of listening. Now 21, David Solano was just 17 when he first became a father. You know, you get a little scared, you know what I mean? Um, you, you were just a kid as well. And now, thanks to what their father has learned. We hang out a lot, we play, you know, those are, they're like my best friends, my kids. Oh yeah, they notice the difference. I know they're happy, <laughs> they're happy. So are their wives who say now there's a lot less tension at home. Solano speaks for all dads when he says. Set a good example for your kids. Um, they will grow up one day and they will want to be someone like you. San Antonio's Compadre y Compadre program at the Children's Shelter could become a statewide model. Its director will be testifying tomorrow in Austin before a Senate, sub, before a Senate committee considering a statewide task force on father engagement. The idea is to promote awareness that fathers indeed are certainly more than half of the equation, especially when it comes to preventing child abuse. We're live downtown. Jesse de Goyado, KSAT 12 News.